most likely PS2. That is the place to start, some people may say. But it's Smashville. The roll behind! The Zoner Classic! Tries to land with the Leaf Shield, but Teradak's ready for it. Gets a nice, thick conversion off of it. Anytime you get 42 on a Mega Man landing, I won't complain about that. Teradax's conversion is looking mighty crispy right now. Teradax's dash back into getting hit by F Smash also looking pretty crispy. Interesting axe. I I wasn't counting the jumps right there because Mega Man, you gotta count. Ooh, rolls right into the Holy Fire. Interesting. We didn't see the roll cover with Holy Fire once, from what I can think of, from Teradax last set. And it's her first off. Oh, don't get hit by that. That's so scary. Oh, Noi3 wanted to get the Z drop right there, but does not get it. Hunting for this last stock, and Teradax is certainly looking to be in danger. But all reliable, dash back F tilt. And yeah, that that Holy Fire is Holy Fire, Holy Water is not a threat to Mega Man. I mean, it, it is, but not to the same extent as other people. Just a solid hunt right there on that edge guard. Patience and uh, more patience. Uh, Noe Three did really good to convert on that, and she's nearly got herself all the way back in this game. But Teradax has held a consistent lead, if not a big one. Although, she's just turned into a pretty big one. Gets the two frame on the axe. Hits him with the, the northwest on the whip coverage. Ooh, no three wanted a big early kill right there. Get Ooh, dash attack. Don't see that a lot from Mega Man, even though I think we've seen her use it like three times already this game. But I know a lot of Mega Man's hate that move. Teradax is bombed up. Goes for the goes for the suicide right there. <laughs> Puts it on Noe 3. Well after there was time for her to get away. Just very pressing the B button through that one. Teradax getting really complacent. Starting to uh flow chart right here, and Noe 3 is looking to finish her off because of that. Teradax's lead is slipping away from her. That lingering fair. I didn't. Oh, Noe 3 is moving right now. It was a bold jump behind into absolutely nothing from Teradax. I imagine that was probably a dropped input. Uh, the raw axe taking out Noe 3. Teradax nowhere near out of this. Already got herself back in the game with these early hit conversions. She's getting big damage off Mega Man in the beginning. And I know Mega Man isn't exactly the most uh, combo-destroying or combo-breaking character, but it's still good to get that damage early. And this is... This is exactly what we saw Stock 2, so... We saw Teradax take an early lead, then we saw Noe 3 start racking up this damage. Start catching Teradax, getting a little complacent. And already, Noe 3 has almost made up this entire deficit. Metal Blade <laughs> destroying everything, or at least trading, which is good enough against Cross. Gets get some lemons in on there. Oh, up beyond a shield. Ooh, tried to get another raw point blank axe. Don't get too framed by that. The Mega Man is heavy. Kind of made out of metal. Was that a whip dangle? Ooh, that F smash catches the holy water. Big whip. Last hit on both characters. Oh my god. Ooh. That was nice from Teradax. We did not see those aerials come out a lot that game. And so to pull it out in that that crucial moment. It's very big. Game one going to Teradax. But 
boy howdy was that close. As far as stage select, Teradax is almost certainly going to ban stages along the lines of... Wait, Teradax picks. No E3, I imagine, will <laughs> ban stages along the likes of... I don't know what she'll ban. Like I said, these characters like a lot of the same stages. I imagine she won't want to... Wait, Teradax does ban stages. Good lord, I should just go to bed. Uh, yeah, I've got no idea where these two are going to go. Um, Teradax, I know, isn't a fan of the slants on Yoshi's, so there's there's one ban from her. They're going straight back to Smashville. I don't see Teradax play here a lot. Um, Actually, maybe that's not the case. I tend to take her here a lot, so... I actually do see her play, see her play here very often. I'm surprised both these players um, like Smashville. It's not exactly what I was expecting from them. Ooh. Interesting grab. I think that may have been a misinput, most likely, but I don't know how unless Noe 3 was doing that second up air with... Or she was trying to catch the shield hold. Either way, Teradax got an edge guard going on here. But Noe 3 just jumps right over it. Mega Man just has so much movement. Uppy's out of it. I don't know if that's like got invincibility or if it's just frame one, so it goes fast. But now that I see it, No 3 Uppy's out of a lot of dangerous situations, but Teradax is ready for these re recoveries on the stage. And she is not letting Noe 3 turn this around on her because she knows if she does, Noe 3 is going to do the exact same thing to her. Teradax building this piecemeal lead, but not letting it go. Gets the Holy Water on the roll, but doesn't commit to the F Smash. Teradax playing it safe. That was a smart non-approach by Noe 3 right there. Lemon's getting through. Ooh, Lemon's, Lemon's getting some movement there. That F smash has gone through. Oh, Teradax nearly got clipped by that Z drop. That F smash has gone through cross a couple times. I don't know if that's a property of it where. That's the Teradax special. Dash back, F tilt, out of range, knows you're going to try to jump in, hits you with that fair. Anyone who doesn't quite escape her ledge trap but makes it on the stage, you'll see it. Also, that rage makes that fair so scary. If she goes off stage with that even just a little bit, you are going to die very early. I mean, look at that. It's already sending off stage at 30. Noe 3 tries to go for the Tri-State Twister. Ooh, the... That's a nice Metal Blade right there. I like that. Now it's Noe 3. We're not seeing the full conversions come out of. Both of these players are really respecting each other. That they aren't going for the full conversions. Also, No3 is getting a lot of mileage out of these lemons. I'd like to see her maybe use them a bit more until Teradax, uh, until Teradax finds out how to deal with them. No3 is going in a lot more. Also, this is a big, long ledge trap going left and right from No3. Still gets hit by that holy water. Teradax catches the fade. Busting through with that forward air. Ooh, I don't... I don't know if No3 wanted that direction. Yeah, Teradax has the weight on that uh, straight down. <laughs> Still got grabbed for it, but very... 
very good air dodge to preserve her stock right there from Noe 3. Oh, Noe 3 had the Tomahawk. There's just so much respect coming out from these two. The, n neither player wants to commit. And I feel in the end, Teradax is going to come out on top from that because Mega Man needs to commit to at least a two-piece if Mega Man wants to kill without getting a uh, big hit in neutral. But Teradax, she can hit with that forward air, that back air, that F-tilt. Especially whenever she gets you offstage. Number three, just run into the other side. Oh, there's, there's the conversion. I'd, I'd really like to see that that confidence come out a lot more from Noe 3 when she doesn't have the invincibility. I Like, it's not that she won't get hit for it, but without it, I don't think she stands a lot of a chance in this matchup because right now Teradax has the advantage with just the projectile game. And also, these lemons getting a lot of mileage. Noe 3 is doing good to use them uh, sparingly, but I mean, you can, you can hear it. They make such a distinct sound. She's used them so much more this stock. The double left smash catches the Belmont classic. The roll behind. Ooh, that was, that was probably a jump holy water from Teradax right there. I know she likes going for that that rare tech coverage right there. Good holy water to get Noe 3 off the state off the ledge, but still, big lead from Noe 3. But not insurmountable by any means from Teradax. Noe 3 just doing everything she can to not let Teradax. Oh! <laughs> I thought Noe 3 did not have that punish when the Metal Blade came out, but she that was really good game sense to know what she could do to still close out that kill on that Holy Water. 1-1 one, one each. We may just see them continually going back to Smashville because or we may see now that it's Teradax's pick we may see her pick a stage she's a little more comfortable on than Smashville according to the official rules we can't go back but ain't no rules of those so also going on in losers we have the rematch no no never mind we have Darnex AK Fires. Darnex who upset Game for Thought earlier. Alright, well they left the arena. Either they're both changing characters, which they aren't, or they're going to a new stage. I don't know where they want to go. I don't know where Teradax wants to go. I don't know what Noe 3 banned. Big game three coming out for both players here. Three, Small battlefield. One, if you ask me, this is probably Noe 3's best stage. She uses these side platforms so well. Teradax is also no stranger to this stage. I know she loves it, but... I took Noe 3 here once, and it <laughs> I learned to never take her, take her here again. So I'm very curious to see what Teradax is going to do. Because right now, Noe 3 has got that lead. 
Unless the axe from across stage. Ooh, doesn't get the little knockup hit on the up smash. I'm frankly amazed that that happened. Oh, the holy water bounces off stage. Still a big, big advantage push uh, from Teradax right there. Putting the game just slightly in her favor. Ooh, oh, that would have been nasty. But F smash in neutral. Ooh, doesn't quite clip her with that metal blade. But hunts with that back air. <laughs> Teradax is like, oh, you're gonna use Rush in the same spot again, I see. Even game. No 3 burnt that invincibility right there. Wanted to get the Metal Blade right away. Didn't realize she had dropped it and it was still on the ground. And then went to go pick it up and then it was gone. Good wait by Teradax. I'm, I'm amazed she did not get hit by that F smash. It's the little things, you know. And you can hear it. You can see it. These lemons, once again, are coming out real big for Noe 3. Doing a good job at keeping the space, interrupting anything Teradax tries to do. That was, a, that was a smooth side B. Going right across the bottom of the stage. Gets right up into the fire. Doesn't get hit by the strong hit of F-Smash. Lives to see another ledge trap. Guard situation. Teradax gets out of the edge guard. She gets out of the ledge trap. She resets it to neutral, gets clipped by the tornado, but doesn't get hit by the big knockback. I've got no idea how that move works. The Tri State Twister, not gonna kill though. Although it is Belmont, so maybe it'll kill. No, Teradax makes it back with that clean whip. Gets swatted out of the air though. Noe 3 is. I don't know what the, I don't know what either of them just did. I was so scared and I don't know for who. Noe 3 isn't on her last hit. Yeah, I had to say it, didn't I? Okay. Uh, <laughs> technically there was two hits, so <laughs> there's my defense. <laughs> Mega Man too low on the getup attack to get hit by that forward tilt. That's very interesting. Noe 3's got a big lead this last stock. Turned Australia in there for a second. Punch in the ground. She definitely wanted to close out with that Metal Blade right there. I don't know how I feel about burning or about showing your hand with such a lead. Because against Teradax, you're going to need to keep a bag of tricks. But finally, after three games, after doing it... Easily more than 30 times. Finally lands that Metal Blade. Teradax could not run forever. No 3 taking game 3 in a really strong fashion there. Like I said at the beginning of that match. Ooh, I have to leave. That is unfortunate. I've got to go at such a critical juncture. Noe 3 looking very poised to take this set, but let's see if Teradax can change her game plan, do something to deal with that Lemons, and hopefully not take her back to small battlefield.